Greetings, gamer girls. I am Celestina, also known as Clone Clocks 999, and welcome back for more Metroid. Last time, we took down Kraid in his domain, and we got a ton of missiles for it. Yeah, I don't know why just killing a boss gets you a ton of missiles, but hey, in the world of Metroid, it does. Anyways, today we're gonna head back up to Brimstar. And we're gonna head to the second boss's lair. Hopefully we can get these guys to drop some, uh, some, uh, health and missiles. Yeah. Yeah, I actually do think the weight beam does a little bit more damage than the, uh, normal beams. I could be wrong, though. If I am, correct me on that. I guess the only thing the wave beams can't penetrate through is the enemies, which makes sense. Okay. So for the next boss, we're gonna want to head to uh, we're gonna head we're, we're gonna want to head back to Norfair. Can I reach that? No, I cannot. Oh, bad game design. Okay, that wasn't really bad game design per se. I know I could just cut to Norfair, but I don't know. I don't really want to. Only, my, only going to cut if people excessively complain about it. In which I'll start doing it more in videos. And I don't really need to kill these enemies. Crap. Alright, so we want to head down. Right. Okay, so we have a grand total of 165 missiles. Awesome. Five hundred ninety-nine health. It's beautiful. Well, max health. I mean seriously. I mean, 30, 30 health is like an estimated, I'm not sure if this is necessarily correct, but like, it's like, it's like 5% of my, of our max health. I wonder if there are any password, password codes you can put in to, uh, make you ha start with, uh, more health than, um, than the 30. That'd be useful. Oh my goodness. Dang it. Alright, here we are in Norfair. Well, we're not in Norfair yet. Now we are. And 
then we got through here. Or is this the way we want to go? Okay, yeah. We just want to head straight, and then we want to go down. You know... You know, as much as I like the Metroid soundtrack and think it's, and think it's, um, and I think it's, uh, almost as good as Mega Man's, I can't really say I like the Norfair, the Norfair song very much. I mean, I still like it, don't get me wrong, I just don't like it as, like, I just don't like it as much as Brinstar or Cradesley. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah, sometimes you don't get hurt from this. Cradesley is probably my favorite song, in, my favorite, uh, music in the game, personally. What's your guys' favorite music in this game? Brinstar, Norfair, Crade's Lair. There's also two other areas which you could spoil in the comments if you want to. Okay, so now we just want to keep heading down. I actually really wanted to finish the game yesterday, but oh well. Can't win them all, can we? Yeah. Plus, um, I got a new game on Steam that I want to get. I want to do a Clone Network video on. Oh, I got two. Actually, I got two new games today. Uh, one on console, one on Steam that I want to do Clone Network videos on. And I really gotta pay pay attention to the camera in case it does black bars. That is one big week. This is using the camera. Wow. Oh wait, no, no, no. Never mind. Alright. Oh yeah, there's an example of those enemies down there just, for some reason, not shooting. So, we're safe from them, but if you're not safe from them, then I don't know what to tell you. Of course, I could just reset the game and make it so it's not cheap, but... Uh, I don't know, I don't want to waste time coming back here. I'm pretty sure you can kill these things. Oh yeah, you can kill them. It's just not, it's just not an idea to. Alright, now we head through here. Still got a little further down to go. Get through here. It's another area. We are in another boss's lair. So first and foremost, uh, there is an energy tag in here, and I'm going to show you where to get it. Uh, let's see. Uh, first, you need to head this way. We're probably going to get a missile tank on the way there. Actually, hold on. I decided to turn my phone brightness up. Because I was actually because I was having out all the way down to save the battery, but... Oh, well. So, I don't believe it's here you want to do it. Oh, yes, it is. Uh, this isn't the way you're... This isn't, uh... This is where the energy tank is, but there's a missile tank we can get. I'm trying to remember where it is we gotta shoot. Oh uh, yeah, right there. Oh crap. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Oh, this might be a little tricky to jump up to, but there you go. Whoa, look out. Just 
screw attack. Love the screw attack. And again, then again, anyone who's played Metroid who doesn't love the screw attack. Gosh, there's so many of these things. Alright, and we got a missile tank! Woo! Alright. Oh, wow. Or at least we're getting a ton of health. Oh, wow! Okay. Dirty trick right there. Oh gosh. Okay, I need to just rush right through and just shoot. Fortunately, we don't have the ice beam anymore, but hey, this is better than the ice beam, at least for this area. I suppose you could have also used uh, missiles on ta uh, on crate, and I really wish I could screw attack. There we go. All right, now we got to do the tedious task of blowing these all up. First world problems, and sometimes they don't blow up. Even more first world problems. All right, let's go. Whoa. So these things don't go out of the scroll. Probably could just screw attack him, which I... It's more dangerous, but I'm probably just gonna do. Well, they get a lot of health, too. Come on. Ah, oh, dang it. Uh, they're pretty much gonna gonna appear like right after you jump over that, or even right before. Screw attack will take care of them. I guess it's an easy way to grind hell. Oh wait, I think I remember what you're supposed to do. I think you're supposed to blow up one of these blocks. I don't remember what it is, which one it was though. I think it's actually all the way at the beginning. Crap, where is it? I'll be back when I find it. Ah, it turns out I was just right here. <laughs> Um, now you have to do this if you want to get through here, so I guess, it would, but I guess it would have been smarter for me to, uh, just, if I remembered that. But, hey, on the bright side, hey, on the bright side, we got a lot more health out of it, but it didn't really matter, matter because, didn't really matter because we're kind of about to get an energy taken. What is going on with all the slowdown? Ah, here we are. Oh! Crap, I forgot about that. <laughs> and getting up or back up is no small feat. Um, I think we could just go around up here, th over here, though. <laughs> I forgot about that trap. It's... Okay. 
Ah, uh, yeah, we can, uh, hop... We can, uh, hop off these. It's a little tricky to do, but we can't, but it's possible. Let us dance, gentlemen. Dance like no one's shooting at us. Okay. I really need to stop referencing that. As, mu as much as I love those voice lo those voice clips. And kudos to you if you know that reference, because it's very obscure. Okay. Oh, jeez. I almost slid, slid off. Oh, crap. No. Ah, yeah, here we are. All right, now we gotta go through here to get it. All right, I might as well just rush through and just keep screw attacking. Unless they come in here with me, which I'm not gonna let happen. Crap, he came in here with me. No worries, we got ourselves an energy tank. And camera, stop, seriously. Why does it do that? Uh, let's see. Uh, now I actually want to drop down here. Uh, I just want to let you know it's right there. Okay, you, you ca ca calculate it yourself. Um, where do I want to go next? Let's see. I we went down there. Okay, I know where I want to go. Okay, so we got 699 in health now. So, almost 700. That's pretty good. Okay, I was trying to jump. I don't know why I didn't. I don't know. But I like game. But I like it when there are games that you can't jump in, like Legend of Zelda, for example. I I get non RPG games. I mean, I mean most RPGs you can't jump in. So and I like RPGs. I like RPGs you can jump in, and I like non RPG games that you can't jump in. And by that I mean jump by pressing a button. And oh. Uh, I forgot how you're supposed to get across this. Just put the bombs here, and then... Ugh, of course I fall. Now, there was a missile tank on the other side of that. If we head this way, if we head this way, we'll go straight to the boss, but I don't want to go, go to quite yet. That means we gotta go all the freaking way or back around. You know what? No. Nope. Screw attack. Okay. Let's we'll test something. Uh, Samus would just stay in the freaking. Stay in the freaking. Oh yeah, I probably would have been able to make it if I just, if I... Oh well. I guess we have to share this area eventually. You gotta be kidding me! I forgot about these things. Why are these things in this area? And th those things look those things look almost like jack o' lanterns.
I don't believe there's anything this way. I think it's just a beginner's trap. Because according to the map I'm using, there is nothing this way, so I'm just going to head back. If you want to check it out for yourself, you can. I really wish they would not put these freaking enemies here. Especially considering this is the only way to get back up. Yeah, I'm looking at the map right now. This is where we're supposed to go. We're actually heading back. We're actually uh, close to the entrance. Uh, uh, excuse me. That was very rude of you. Okay, so now we're back at the entrance. Now if we could just not fail, that'd be nice. this again. strange feeling that come on I have a strange feeling I'm not gonna make it here again I'll be right back there's a missile there's a missile tank on the other side of this that I want to get and I mean I know five missile I know five extra missiles isn't really gonna be harming me much through much in the game but I kind of re I really just kind of want to get it but and I'm pretty sure I've gotten it before, so I'm just gonna try this. WHY DID YOU GET OUT OF THE BALL FARM?! Ugh. Okay, you know what? I'm just not gonna get it. I might get it later, but I'm not gonna get it now. When we head through here... Oh, let me get that first. Oh! Yeah. Uh, by the way guys, um, what if, what if, uh, today, earlier today I got, um, Super Metroid, which is the, uh, third game in the, uh, in the Metroid series. So by now you should have 175 missiles, not 170. I might, I might like load this, load this up on the emulator and just uh, use save states and then use the password I got, I got in there to it uh, and use it here. I don't know if I have a ROM for uh, 
for a Metroid, though. Okay! Meet this. Meet the boss. This is is Ridley, who is said to be Samus's arch rival. Now, a cheap tactic that I always do I always do is just stay down here and shoot him. It's now I know it I know it's cheap and all, but when you really think about when you really think about it, this game is already hard enough as it is. So I think I'm just gonna stay down here and, sh here and shoot him from above. We are steadily taking damage, but he's losing health faster than we are. So yeah, I think you could even do this without the various suit if you're skilled enough. Like you know the plus those projectiles block the wave beams, so I think it's better just to do this. If you need to take if you need to take a jump every once in a while, it might be an idea if you're not wearing the various suit. Fortunately, those fireballs are causing the game to lag a lot or slow down. You know, it's kind of funny if it's on the computer, it's called lag, but if it's on the console, it's called slow down. And for that, we get a whole, a whole ton of it. We get. 75 more missiles, and we should have 250, not 205. Or, come on, jump out. And thankfully, the, uh... And thankfully, the... Thankfully, the, um... Thankfully, the, uh... The energy tank is not in, in, a, in a weird place to get, so... We just have to go through here. That's the only purple wall in the game that requires 10 missiles to get through. Hey, stop unfairly attacking me. Oh, then again, we're coming out of this virtually unscratched. And here we go. Here's the energy tank. But wait, we still have six energy tanks. Well, that brings me to explain how energy tanks works in this game. In this game, uh, in this game at least, you can only hold a maximum of six energy tanks, giving you a total of of uh, 699 health. Sorry, but that's just the way it is. But collecting the energy tank would collecting the energy tank will allow you to will allow you to um, collecting the energy tank will allow you to collecting. God, what am I trying to say here? Collecting the energy tank will restore you to full full health, so it's not a total loss, but. Uh, Anyways, guys, I think we're going to end it or end the video here. Uh, I'm gonna off. I'm gonna off screen getting that. Uh, getting that other. I'm gonna off screen getting that other. That other what's it called missile tank? S and, well, not off screen. Uh, just um, just uh, safe state till I get it. And I'll let you know when I'm on the other side. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. And as always, remember to smile. You are the face of low clock, standing in the nine gaming. Goodbye.